Good morning, good morning, good morning. I'm headed to my second laser appointment for the week. I was initially supposed to be doing all of my laser hair treatments in one day. I am doing underarms, Brazilian, and also my chin. And so Monday, I went to do it, which was yesterday. And I was like, girl, I don't know if I'm ready for that pain. Let me come back next month and do my Brazilian. And honestly, it didn't hurt as bad as I thought it was going to. And they slightly convinced me to come back because basically if I decide to do them on different cycles, I won't be synced up. So I'll always have to come back two different times for my appointments, which is not very efficient. So I am just going to go back today so that I can do my Brazilian. The hardest part for me is shaving. It's quite literally so, 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 so annoying. And I managed to get through it. Um, so yeah, we'll, we'll see how this, how this goes. The reason why I say yesterday was not too bad is because they have uh, like chirotherapy or something like that. Something that makes it cold as soon as it shoots out, it shoots out a burst of cold air. I didn't get all the hairs that I needed to get. So I know I'm, it's gonna be a little spicy regardless of the little cold spurt that it's going to give out. But let's, let's see, let's see. So I'm gonna just tough through it and see what it gives. Hopefully it doesn't give crazy painful. I mean, I feel like the worst part is over. I think, unless you're going back. <laughs> no, we're good. Okay. Okay. What? How was that? It was good. Girls. If you aren't a girl or don't identify as a girl, you're gonna identify as a girl today. Girls, that was so much easier than I thought it was gonna be. I'm shocked. It literally took maybe five minutes or less. We'll see what the lick read when my hair start growing back to like for sure, for sure know if she's working and doing what she needs to do. But like, I'm really shocked. Like the inners, I thought was gonna be the most painful part. It did have some stinging, but overall, it was so tolerable. My chin hurt a little bit more than my Brazilian, maybe because I have like excess pigmentation, but chin, four out of 10. Brazilian, 4.5, five out of 10. Even if, I wouldn't even go that high with Brazilian. 4.5 out of 10. Underarms, for me, was like a two out of 10. Wow. If you have a Semper laser hair removal in your area, just go. Because that cold air that shoots out really does make a difference. Laser was so much more uncomfortable when I was doing it and it did not have that. That cold air that shoots out makes so much of a difference. Pain who? Pain where? Pain why? I'm shocked. We kept seeing DM after DM after comment after comment like, what about Florida? I'm like, I got you, I got you. We're gonna figure it out. So tonight I want this to be special. I want this, this is gonna be like a regular division concert. If you want conversations in the diner, make some noise right now. If you want POV, make some noise right now. Here, here, he said, fuck that guy anyways. You wanna do it? You can dance? Are you sure? Everybody's pointing to you, so you, you know what you're doing like that? You know, okay, come on, come on, come on. 
We appreciate you guys, and I don't know how we're not gonna come back here, so we're gonna have to make a point and get back here ASAP. All right, we always come back to you. I know it is love. Left the vision and it was good. How'd you feel? I feel cold. It is very cold. <laughs> Division, division, division. Daniel in 1985. I don't know what his government name is, but it was a really good show. I got loge seatings at the House of Blues at Dizzy Springs. And what those are are like reserved seating on the second floor. So you're overlooking the stage a little bit. And honestly, I would say those are really good seats. I was in the center. And even though you're sharing a pew, <laughs> It's, it's a pew i can't call it anything else you're sharing a pew with four other people they still are really good seats my only problem is that if you are sitting in those seats with people who need a little bit extra room it becomes tight but it was still a good show daniel can sing and that's great because if he couldn't babe give me a reflection of the day i've already done what i'm grateful for and what was better today than yesterday. What's something you look forward to in the future? What is something that you look forward to in the future is the reflection of the day. I look forward to continuing to document my life in whatever way that takes me. Sometimes I feel like you have these plans for yourself and God is like, <laughs> I'll show you. So I'm looking forward to documenting my journey in whatever way that looks like and just honoring my journey, honoring my path and just being authentic in it. So aside from seeing my future as a mom, a wife, um, a better friend, a better sibling, a better daughter, I look forward to seeing just where my life takes me. So if you would like to answer the reflection of the day, feel free to do so. Today is the end of day six of Vlogmas, which sounds really exciting. We have 24 more days left. No, do we have 24? It's not 30 days. We have, 20, 30, I don't know. I think we have 19 days left. Or we might have 20. I'm Okay, we have 19 to 20 more days left because I might have an extra video. Clearly my voice is shot from the concert, but we have about 19 to 20 more days left for Vlogmas. So I will see you tomorrow. Feel free to answer the question in the comments. And I hope you have a great rest of your day. I will see you tomorrow. <laughs>